Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. Let us now start studying solid shapes. Let us start studying a cuboid. We know that cuboid is formed by joining of rectangles. and each rectangle is called its face so each side of this cuboid is its face the points where these faces meet are called the vertices and the lines where these faces meet are called the edges. We can compare a cuboid to a room. Then we have four walls and the roof and the floor. Hence, a cuboid has six faces. If we count the vertices, we get eight vertices and we have twelve edges. If L is the length of this cuboid and B is the breadth and H is the height then its lateral surface area that means the area of the four walls is equal to 2H into L plus B and its total surface area that is the area of the four walls plus the roof plus the floor will be equal to 2 times length into breadth plus breadth into height plus height into length. Let us consider this cube. We can see that it is very similar to the cuboid only with the difference that length, breadth and height are same. So all sides are equal means length is equal to breadth is equal to height a cube also has six faces twelve edges and eight vertices Lateral surface area of the cube is 4L square and a total surface area is 6L square. Let us consider a cylinder. Then cylinder consists of a curved surface and a circular top and a circular bottom. So the actual cylinder looks like this. Now let us consider that height of the cylinder is H and its radius is R. Then the curved surface area of the cylinder is equal to 2 pi Rx. And its total surface area is equal to the curved surface area plus area of the two lids that is area of the circles which is equal to 2 pi r h plus 2 
pi r square which is equal to 2 pi r common in brackets r plus h hence total surface area of the cylinder is 2 pi r r plus h let us read the question an aquarium is in the form of a cuboid whose external measures are 80 centimeters 30 centimeters and 40 centimeters the base the side faces and back face are to be covered with a colored paper find the area of the paper needed we are given that aquarium is in the form of a cuboid so let us consider a cuboid we are given that the external measures are 80 centimeters 30 centimeters and 40 centimeters next we have to cover the base the side faces and the back face with the paper so let us start with calculating area of the base that will be equal to length into breadth which is equal to 80 centimeters into 30 centimeters which is equal to 2400 centimeters square next we have to calculate area of the side faces one of the side faces is this one and the other is this one so let us calculate the area of one of the faces it will be breadth into height which is equal to 30 into 40 centimeter square which is equal to 1200 centimeter square now let us calculate the area of the back face our back face is not visible to us completely but we know that it is parallel to the front face so the dimensions will be 80 and 40 and hence our area will be length into height which is equal to 80 into 40 centimeter square which is equal to 3200 centimeter square so area of the paper needed is equal to area of the base plus area of back face plus 2 times the area of side face let us substitute the values we will get 2400 plus 3200 plus 2 into 1200 which is equal to 8000 centimeter square hence we say that area of paper required is 8000 centimeter square